Did you ever have a hard time breaking your hand trying to play that cool Joe Perry riff from Walk This Way? Maybe there could be a more efficient way to do it. So here I'm going to show you that right, right here, right now. Here we go. I know I'm playing this on a telly. That's all wrong. There's not enough dirt on it. Too bad. The first thing is, this is essentially a funk guitar part. So you need to get your right hand moving. One e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a. And everything is going to be approached that way. So it builds off something like this. It becomes kind of tiring, maybe even exhausting to do, particularly if you have your guitar strapped on as low as Joe Perry's guitar. Here's an alternative fingering to that that hopefully will make your life easier. If there's one little thing I can do to make your life easier, I hope this is it. Okay, so instead of holding this whole thing like this, do a little shift. You've got a little muted note right there. Notice I'm kind of keeping my fingers flat on the strings. I'm only going to be shifted down to the 8th fret for the first two notes of the riff. This one and this one. And then I shift up to the 12th. Little bar there. Really slow. Notice I'm putting a few different endings on there. Have fun, be creative. That ought to do it. I hope that helped you out and made your life just that much easier. Enjoy playing Walk This Way. If you liked what you saw today, please like, share, subscribe, tell everyone you know, put it on your socials, all of that stuff. Thank you for stopping by.